Let's start by considering the expression 1 plus 1 minus x upon 1 plus x. Taking a common denominator, this can be written as 1 plus x plus 1 minus x divided by 1 plus x. x cancels in the numerator and therefore this expression is equal to 2 divided by 1 plus x. Now raise both sides to the power minus n. Therefore, 1 plus 1 minus x upon 1 plus x raised to the power minus n is equal to 2 upon 1 plus x raised to the power minus n, which can be written as 1 plus x upon 2 raised to the power n, which in turn is equal to 1 plus x raised to the power n upon 2 raised to the power n. We therefore have the result 1 plus x raised to the power n is equal to 2 raised to the power n times 1 plus 1 minus x upon 1 plus x raised to the power minus n. Using binomial theorem to expand the right hand side, we get 2 raised to the power n times in brackets 1 minus n times 1 minus x upon 1 plus x plus minus n times minus n minus 1 upon 2 factorial times 1 minus x upon 1 plus x whole square plus and so on. This simplifies to 2 raised to the power n times in brackets 1 minus n times 1 minus x upon 1 plus x plus n times n plus 1 upon 2 factorial times 1 minus x upon 1 plus x whole square plus and so on, which is the desired result.